<laughs> Have you ever heard the saying, too much of a good thing is a bad thing? Okay, let's take ice cream for example. We probably all agree it's great. But if you only eat ice cream for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, you'll get sick, which is not so great. With most things in life, the key to being healthy and happy is moderation. That is, enjoy a little bit at a time. The same holds true for computers. We spend so much time in front of screens that we need to learn to take care of ourselves, or we could get sick. For example, did you know that blinking is a natural way for our body to protect our eyes? We do it 15 to 20 times per minute without even thinking about it. But when we stare at a screen, we tend to blink just 4 or 5 times per minute. That's bad for the eyes because they can get dry. Other body parts can also suffer from sitting in front of a screen for too long. Your hands and wrists will ache from typing. Your back and neck will become sore. Even your butt will start to hurt. Worst of all, your mind will feel like it's stuck in the mud. Now here's a quick recipe for staying healthy. Take a break every 15 minutes to give your eyes and body a rest. Get out of your chair. Maybe even take a short walk. If you have a window in the room, take a look outside. Now stretch your back, neck, and arms and reach for the sky. No, higher. That's better. Because sitting at a computer is the exact opposite of exercise, you should take a more active break every hour or so. Step away from the computer for five minutes. Go for a brief walk around the house, talk to your parents and siblings, or just drink a glass of water. How about a few jumping jacks? When you get back to your computer after an active break, you will be more focused and your body will feel refreshed. Remember that all activities affect our bodies. Not just sports, but also sitting in front of a screen, be it a TV, computer, or your smartphone. That's right, take a break. Get active, stay healthy. Your body and mind will thank you, and you'll get more done.